flag. This here's my compass. See that needle there? Well, no matter which way you're facing, it always points toward the north. Over that way is Fodderwing's house. And over that way is Boston, where Miss Twink lives. And over that way is where we live, Flag. Hey, Flag, that ain't nothing for you to eat. Uh, uh, oh, oh, oh. you want to get him. Here we go. Foresters. Sounds like they're onto something big, Flag. Come on. Let's go. Hey, Pa, what's wrong? Slewfoot's been seen nearby. <gasps> you mean he might come round here tonight, then? If he does, I think it's best to be ready. Then do you think that Flag could sleep inside the house tonight, Pa? Is that the reason why you're looking so happy? Uh, oh, that ain't true. I, I don't look happy, do I, Flag? How's that? A little bit higher. So what's the big rush on finishing this dress, anyway? So that I can wear it the day after tomorrow when we go into town. Oh. Hmm? What was that? I thought I heard something. Oh, it was probably just Jody and Flag playing. I don't think so. <clears throat> uh, what's wrong? Jody, don't let Flag play outside the house. Um. Here, Julia. Was it Slewfoot? It got to our pig. Julia, you weren't doing your job. He outsmarted us. I never thought that he'd come while we were still awake. Jody, you were making too much uh, noise. Julia didn't hear him either, and she was outside. Get everything ready, Ori. I'm going hunting. Oh, you don't mean right now, do you? That's exactly what I mean. Pa, can I come along with you? If you get too tired, I'll leave you behind. Okay. And we ain't coming back till we get Slewfoot. Okay. Uh, but what about the day after tomorrow? I'll just uh, have to meet you there. That is, if we can kill Slewfoot by then. You expect me to go into town all by myself? Old Slewfoot's acting pretty careless. If I miss this chance, we may never be rid of that no good bear. <laughs> Or Slewfoot's, Pa. They sure are. Let's go. Yeah. Pretty hard work, ain't it, Pa? Yeah, it's a man's work. So, Jody, you have any idea why I decided to finish off old Slewfoot all of a sudden? No. Well, this ain't the first time he's attacked our livestock, you know. He's been attacking settlers' livestock ever since he ran out of food in the hills. But this time it's different. This time he's killing for his own pleasure. And 
killing for pleasure is where I draw the line. He really did it this time. Huh? Looks like he crossed the swamp. Are we going to cross it too? If we turn back now, he'll only attack us again later. Pretty cold, eh? No, no, it's okay. <laughs> Let's go. You think we'll catch up with Slewfoot? He's just as tired as we are. Besides, I want your clothes to dry off before we go on. Oh, yeah. Here. Thanks, Pa. How is it? A real man's drink, huh? Uh huh. <laughs> Maybe we can spend the night in that house there. But ain't we gonna go after Slewfoot? Patience is the key to winning our battle with Slewfoot. Uh, 